Well, and it's not just me, Alex and Christine. Good evening, everybody. Lots of smiles out here today. We're uh, along the uh, the promenade right outside the convention center. The racing took place just to my left on the streets of Long Beach. And yes, indeed, a lot of excitement. And for a couple of reasons. One, the Grand Prix is back, as Alex mentioned. And also, number two, well, just the fact that people were able to come out and enjoy this race could be a sign that we're putting that pandemic slowly behind us. They're revved up and running at the Acura Grand Prix of Long Beach. And after going silent last year because of COVID, the fans are revved up too. It's been great. This is uh, my first race that I've been to pretty much since uh, COVID started, and it's great to be back at the track. There's nothing quite like the sound of high-performance machines whizzing by at 200 miles per hour. Grand Prix fans say there's nothing quite like having the chance to get back out and view an event like this in person. It's awesome, right? You don't, didn't realize what you missed, just being able to be out and see these cars and hear these cars go by. Unbelievable. Yeah, I've never been to one of these races. My boyfriend dragged me along, and it's actually a really good time. The Grand Prix circuit is almost two miles long. Plenty of room to accommodate the almost 200,000 fans who come out even with COVID restrictions still in place. Well, they had a vaccination uh, request line where everybody needed to have their vaccination proof of ID. And it kind of took a little while for some people, but I managed to get in. They give you a bracelet and everything. Round and round they go. Hyper speed cars with drivers who oftentimes become like rock stars to these fans. It's a good show for sure. It's one of California's spectacles. A, a, a rare chance to see high performance cars and celebrities. And not only are there celebrity sightings here, you can also spot the folks who keep a close watch on those celebrities. So what on God's green earth are you doing here? You know me, I love cars and stars. What I'm... entertainment value is there here for you? I have the need for speed. <laughs> the need for speed, the ubiquitous Amanda Salas. She's here, she's there, she's everywhere, and she'll be right back on the air tomorrow morning on Good Day LA, so you can catch her then. In the meantime, not gonna tell you who won the race, but I will tell you that he's a local guy, and it's his second win in a row on the Grand Prix circuit. That's it from Long Beach. Rick Lozano reporting, Fox 11 News. Alex Christine will send it back to you.